In the name of everything that is holy, do not buy an LG 40 Hertz OLED right now because right around the corner, we might be getting something that for some could be significantly better. What am I talking about? Well, according to a videocards.com article, ViewSonic might be launching two new OLEDs and the one I wanna talk about today for sure is going to be apparently a 27 inch 1440p 520 hertz QD OLED monitor with very likely a glossy finish. Now there's a number of reasons as to why this would be a significantly better purchase in my opinion over the LG 480 hertz models. And let's talk about why right now. Now as good as those 480 hertz monitors are, they have a couple of problems that certainly irked me in my review. And one of them is gonna be the lower color performance than QD OLED can give you. LG's W OLED panels, likely due to the white subpixel, unfortunately don't give as good of color, at least in HDR. So if you're into HDR gaming, this upcoming one from ViewSonic is likely gonna be giving you better visuals. But speaking of visuals, the other thing that I didn't love about the LG 40 Hertz OLEDs is the matte coating. Now, it's not as big of a deal at 1440p as it is at 4K in my opinion, but the glossy coating on the QD OLEDs is gonna give you a much crisper image. And as long as you can have QD OLED in a semi-light controlled room, you shouldn't get that magenta tint and that extra clarity is gonna be a massive boost to the readability of, well, everything on your screen. And if I was given the choice, I would certainly wait for this, especially considering that it's likely gonna come in at a similar price point. It seems like these Samsung panels are very aggressive typically in comparison to LG. So I certainly wouldn't expect them to be significantly more expensive. So why not wait for something that's better for the same price? That's the way that I see it. Now, the 520 Hertz versus 480 Hertz, let's be honest, most people probably wouldn't even notice that. However, it is higher and while in theory, you should have to lock it to around 450 Hertz to 100% for sure, get G-Sync working without any tearing whatsoever, hey, who knows, maybe you can actually lock it to a flat 500 hertz and get the most synced up performance possible with 500 hertz flat and 1000 hertz pulling or 2000 hertz pulling on your mouse, everything all synced up perfectly. Maybe you can get that to work. And if that's the case, hey, that'll be yet another benefit to having that slightly higher refresh rate. Although you might need a monitor that's even faster than 520 hertz to make that happen. But regardless, it's faster, it's gonna be clear, it's gonna give you better color, and who knows, it might be using a newer panel technology, and maybe you'll even get brighter HDR as well for a more impactful and dynamic experience. It's certainly worth waiting to at least see what it looks like when it comes out. So if you want something that's, in my opinion, likely to be better in almost every single measurable way, I would certainly wait for this monitor. As for eSports, this may be the best thing you can possibly buy if you want the fastest, clearest experience possible. And I don't think we'll be seeing anything too much faster than this for at least a little bit. Now, sounds like they're also releasing a 4K 240Hz slash 480Hz model, although that's likely to be using an LG panel, so it's also likely going to be matte. So for me, probably gonna pass on that one as, especially at 4K, that does have a significant impact on the overall end clarity for the user. But regardless, great to see more people coming into the OLED market and pushing things even higher than ever as currently QD OLED taps out at 360 Hertz. So to go from 360 to 520, <laughs> fellas, what a jump. Can you believe it? I certainly can't, but looks like it's coming and so am I. So make sure you're subscribed for everything else display related here on the Display Guy. Whether you're looking to connect a new console, gaming PC, or just need a fast and reliable HDMI cable to connect over long distances, Rupro has you covered with their certified 8K HDMI 2.1 fiber optic cable available in sizes of up to 50 feet and can deliver a perfect full 48 gigabits per second connection over distances other cables could only dream of reaching. And with 48 gigabits per second of bandwidth, it can easily drive 8K 60 FPS or 4K 144 FPS 10-bit HDR video through its ultra-thin, flexible, and durable housing and it even supports ER. So if you're in the market for a cable that can drive a beautiful new TV or monitor, be sure to check out RuPro on Amazon today.